ladies, welcome to my channel. My name is Heather Anderson of So Heather, and I am super excited about today's video. I'm gonna be sharing seven ways to dress more confident. But before I get started, I did hit a big milestone. I hit 40,000 subscribers on YouTube, and I just wanted to let each and every one of you know how grateful I am for your support, for your love, for your comments, for watching my videos. Like, I truly, truly appreciate each and every one of you. So I just wanted to give my gratitude and thanks to all of you. So thank you so much. Also, I want to thank Express for sponsoring this video. Express has been one of my favorite places to shop since I was in my 20s. And now that I'm in my 40s, I still shop at Express because they offer amazing pieces, high quality pieces, but all of them are very affordable. So every look that I'm going to be sharing in today's video is extremely chic, extremely amazing, extremely affordable, and it will also help you look and feel very confident because I believe looking at your best will help you feel confident and confidence will get you anywhere you want to go. So that is exactly why I made this video. And if that sounds good to you, if you would please hit that little subscribe button if you haven't already, because I do publish two new videos every single week. Okay, listen to this entire video because the last tip to look more confident, in my opinion, is the absolute most important tip. And if you only remember one tip from this entire video, it should be the last tip. Okay, so tip number one to look more confident when you get dressed every single day is to remember the ABC rule. You might be asking, what is the ABC rule? Well. A stands for accentuate, B stands for balance, and C stands for camouflage. So what you wanna remember is to always accentuate your best feature. In order to do that, you must first know what your best feature is, and I'm sure that you do. For me, I love my waist, so I wear a lot of things to show off my waist, such as um, high-waisted skinny jeans, such as form-fitting midi dresses, such as always adding a third layer, wearing jackets that really cut in at the waist. So if that is you, if you love your waist, then wear things that accentuate your waist. If you love your legs, then wear more, more skirts, wear more dresses that hit you right above the knee or maybe a little bit lower, you know, the midi dress length. Like whatever it is for you, know what your best feature is and accentuate that. The B stands for balance. So if you're going to wear a shorter skirt because you love your legs, then always balance out that look by adding a jacket, for example. So if you're gonna show skin on the bottom of your body, then you cover up the top portion of your body and vice versa. Now the C stands for camouflage. So maybe you don't love your legs. Well then don't wear shorter skirts or shorter dresses. You might always opt for pants or jeans or something that covers your legs, such as a maxi skirt. You know, think about if you don't love your arms, maybe you do always wear a jacket because you're not, you know, you kind of wanna cover up your, your arms. Maybe your arms are a little bit on the bigger side or what have you. So whatever that is, just know your body and follow the ABC rule. So the looks I wanna feature that really showcase this tip for me is this mint green midi dress because again i said that i really loved my waistline so these form fitting midi dresses really show off my late my waistline i love the color of this dress i think mint green just screams spring and summer it is a ribbed knit material so it's wrinkle free it's very high quality um it's very comfortable like i literally feel like i'm wearing pajamas when i have on this dress it is under a hundred dollars it comes in three colors including black so in case mint green isn't your color you could certainly opt for one of the other colors now what I want to point out is I'm five foot four obviously the model is much taller than me which is why this dress hits her above the knee so depending on how tall you are the dress will hit you in a different part of your leg so like I said I'm five foot four so the dress hits me below the knee I personally like a midi dress meaning a dress that hits below the knee. I just think it's very slimming and very flattering. 
Then what I topped this dress with is this beautiful tweed blazer, also from Express. You guys, I'm literally obsessed with this blazer. You will see it styled several different ways in this video because it is that good, it is that versatile, and that wearable. It looks way more expensive than it really is because it's made of this very high quality tweed material. It is an ivory shade, so being a neutral shade, it's literally going to match everything. I really love the Lux um, gold buttons. It is a structured blazer, so it does a great job of showing off your figure. If you want to show off your waist, if that's one of your favorite features, then this jacket would be a great way to do that because it is cut in at the waist just as a well-structured blazer should be. Now, if you are a woman that doesn't have much of a waist, maybe you're more of a boxy frame, for example, you could still rock this blazer and look amazing because since it is cut in at the waist, it will actually create the illusion of you having a waist even if you really don't have one. And then I just did these snake print mules. I actually featured these in a video I did last month with Express. So I will be sure and link that down below in my description box. But these mules are fabulous. They're a very neutral print, a snake print of like this really beautiful gray and ivory shades mixed together. So they go with everything. They're very comfortable because the heel height is I think three or three and a half inches and it is more of a block style heel and an open toe making them extremely comfortable. If I had to say, what is the most comfortable style of heel? Because I do get that question a lot from you guys. I would definitely say an open toe mule because it doesn't have a back and then the toe is open so your toes aren't like squished in there. So love these heels. I literally wear them all the time and the price point is also very budget friendly. Okay, tip number two in order to feel more confident when you're getting dressed is to stop worrying about what other people think. Here's what you have to think about. If you feel good and you feel amazing and you feel like yourself when you put something on, that's all that matters. Don't worry about what other people think. Just worry about what you think because truly you are what matters. The way you feel on the inside is going to exude confidence if it is a good feeling. So just remember that every time you get dressed. Certainly don't compare yourself to others. You are, you are your own person. There is no one like you. God made all of us differently. And so just be thankful that there is no one like you and you are amazing and you are fabulous and you are confident. And if you remember that in your mind and you stop comparing yourself to other people, it will definitely make a difference in the way you present yourself. So one thing I love wearing and you guessed it, I'm sure you probably know if you've been watching my channel for a while, is an amazing pair of jeans and a jacket and some fabulous heels. So I did style this ivory blazer this time with an amazing pair of denim. These are light wash skinny jeans from Express. They're extremely high waisted. Um, again, accentuating one of my favorite features of my body, which is my waist. The reason they make you look taller and slimmer is because they are extremely high waisted. I think they have a 12 inch rise, which for me, that is perfect. It hits above my belly button and it actually goes around the thinnest part of my waist. So that is why these jeans are so flattering. I particularly love this light wash for spring. I think it's perfect. I think light wash denim, like that really pale light wash is probably my favorite color of denim to wear in the spring and summer. These are under $100, so what a great deal. They do have minimal distressing, so I think they're tastefully sexy and very, you know, a bit edgy, which matches my personal style perfectly. And yes, they are comfortable. Another thing I love about Express Jeans is that you can order them in different lengths. So you can do a short, a regular, or a tall. So for me, I'm again, I'm five foot four, and I did the zero regular, and they fit perfectly. I think I could have gotten away with getting the short. They would have just been a couple of inches shorter, hitting right above my ankle bone. So I think, honestly, I could have done the regular or the short. So it's really just your personal, personal preference. And then, of course, I just did the snake print mules, proving their versatility and wearability. All right, tip number three in order to feel more confident is to know what your signature style is. I did a whole video on this last year, but I'm thinking about doing a new video on this, so let me know if you would like to see that. But knowing your signature style, what does that mean? That means that you have a certain outfit formula that you tend to gravitate towards. 
and that's really what you wear almost every day. And that is definitely what I do. I have a signature style. It is basically a jacket of some sort, whether that be a blazer, a leather jacket, and then a simple cami or bodysuit or t-shirt. And then of course, a fabulous pair of denim. And yes, I always wear heels. Why? Because that is what makes me feel like the best version of myself. So if you don't already have your own signature style, think about what you love to wear. Think about what makes you feel good on the inside when you wear that, what you feel most comfortable in, and that is what you should wear most days. So the looks I wanna talk about with this tip well, first I wanna talk about accessories. So to complete my signature looks, I always add in necklaces and I always wear heels. So first I wanna talk about this amazing necklace from Express. It is gold and silver. That's another one, that's another thing that I think really matches my signature style and something that I do always is I always wear a neck stack and it's always gonna have silver and gold in it. So the exact necklaces that I'm wearing are not available on the Express website, but I did find this really cool necklace at Express. It's under $50. It is a gold chain, very similar to the gold chain that I'm wearing right now, like a paper clip gold chain and then it's got another silver chain underneath it so it's mixing metals which i think is very modern very edgy very chic and this is a necklace that you could literally put on with every single one of these looks and just make yourself look more polished more put together and just have the look be more elevated so this will complete your signature style is a signature piece of jewelry so absolutely love this gold chain necklace from express and again it is under 50 dollars, so it is a very budget friendly another thing that i always wear with my looks are heels i've already talked about the the um, snake print mules which i absolutely love and i wear them a ton but another pair of mules that i want to feature are also from Express. These are a beige color. They're beautiful. This neutral shade will literally match everything because the heel height is fairly low. It's under three inches or maybe three inches exactly. They're very wearable, very comfortable. And again, because they are in open toe mule style, they will literally, you'll be able to wear them like every single day. And because of this neutral beige shade, they will go with everything. You could wear them with any of the items I've chosen in this video and you will look amazing and look fabulous. Okay, so the first look I wanna talk about uh, featuring my signature style is this amazing rust colored bodysuit. So you know I love bodysuits, why? Because they're very slimming. You don't have to worry about them bunching up or coming untucked. This one is very soft. It's made of this very soft like jersey material. I love the way it's cut in at the shoulders so it's very tastefully sexy. You can wear this bodysuit alone, but then you can also drape a jacket over it, which I think is incredibly chic and for me my signature style I always love topping my looks with jackets because I just think it pulls the look together making me feel more confident making me feel like the best version of myself so I topped this look with the beautiful ivory blazer that I talked about earlier this blazer reminds me of a premium designer blazer it looks expensive it looks luxe although it is not. It is just a gorgeous, gorgeous blazer that I think would be a great staple in any woman's wardrobe. And then I did the light wash skinny jeans I had on earlier, very high-waisted, very slimming. They're gonna make you look taller and slimmer, I promise. And also they're very comfortable and under $100. And then of course I did the snake print mules, proving their versatility and wearability. Okay, look number two would be a leather jacket. So I either wear a blazer or a moto jacket probably 90% of the time. This is a beautiful white faux leather jacket. I featured this in my video last month with Express, but I wanted to feature it again in today's video because it is such a phenomenal jacket. It looks way more expensive than it really is. It's made of this beautiful white, faux leather so it looks and feels like real leather i love this silver hardware and i just think a white faux leather or real leather jacket is a definite spring and summer staple that every woman needs in her wardrobe i literally wear this jacket at least once or twice a week because it goes with everything. I paired it over this under $50, um, sort of like a peachy nude bodysuit also from Express, very reasonably priced. I think it's around $30. And then these light wash jeans are amazing because they're more of a slim straight. They're still high-waisted, of course, but these are more of a slim, like modern skinny jean. So 
If you're the type of woman that doesn't want to wear like the super skinny jean, then I would highly recommend these because again, they're not going to be as form fitting as like the traditional skinny jean. They're more of like a modern straight leg jean, but they're still very flattering and very versatile because of this really cool light denim. And they're also under a hundred dollars and extremely comfortable. Now, as you can see, these are a little bit shorter than the other jeans I'm wearing because these are the short version. So I did try these in the short, probably could have gotten the regular. So either way, if you want your jeans a little bit on the shorter side, I would say order the short size if you want them a little bit longer than obviously the regular, but it's totally gonna depend on how tall you are. And again, I'm five foot four for reference. All right, tip number four is to know what colors look best on you. The reason is if you know what colors really bring out your eyes or make your hair look beautiful or really you know, pair well with your skin tone, if you wear those colors more often, then you're just gonna feel better about yourself. You're going to feel more confident. So for me, I look really good in blue and also in greens. And then even like pale colors, pastel colors. So this mint green blazer that I'm wearing, actually I'm wearing it in today's video. I absolutely love it. Obviously it's from Express. This is more of an oversized blazer. So it's very fashion forward, very on trend. One of the biggest trends we're seeing in 2021 is the oversized jacket, whether that be an oversized blazer or an oversized moto jacket. This blazer is wrinkle free. It's very high quality. I love the beautiful gray button on it. I think the fit is amazing. It's still flattering, even though it is oversized. And I thought it looked really cool paired over the mint green mini dress that I talked about earlier, also from Express. This monochromatic look I think is just stunning. It's statement making. I'm actually going to attend a luncheon later this week, and this is exactly what I'll be wearing. And then of course I did the neck stack and my the amazing snake print mules that are very comfortable and very wearable. Now, another way to style this mint green blazer is with denim. So I paired it over this beautiful silver camisole that I talked about earlier. Yes, it's on sale for like $21. And then I did the gray skinny jeans. These are also from Express. They're the same exact silhouette as the light wash skinny jeans I talked about earlier. So the, the rise is very high, making them very flattering, very slimming. These are a zero regular. So that again, they're a regular length hitting right at my ankle bone or a little bit below. These are very comfortable. I also love gray denim to wear in the spring and summer. So highly recommend these jeans. If you haven't already added a pair of gray denim to your spring and summer denim collection, I highly recommend it. And these are also super affordable coming in at under $100. All right, tip number five in feeling more confident when you get dressed is to only wear one trend piece. So I think that if you try to wear too many trend pieces, you might look like you're trying too hard. You might feel like you're trying too hard and that will definitely not portray confidence. So no matter what your age, you certainly can get away with wearing at least one trend piece in an outfit if you want to. You certainly don't have to, but I personally love trying trends. I think it's fun. I think it's amazing. And of course I do it for a living. So like I have to try trends so that, you know, to kind of give you guys some advice on which trends are wearable and which ones are not. So I think one very wearable trend that I actually am really loving right now is the puff sleeve trend. One reason I love this trend is because it actually makes your waist look smaller because you're adding bulk to your shoulders. So this beautiful eyelet white bodysuit from Express, it's under $60. I think it is literally like the perfect spring top. I'm going to name it the perfect spring top because I love it that much. I think it's amazing. It's an easy and cute top to wear out to dinner, to wear to a lunch with your girlfriends, to wear on a date night. Like the possibilities are endless because this top is just beautiful. You could certainly wear it alone like I've done here, but you could also top any one of the jackets that I've featured in today's video over this bodysuit and look fabulous and look amazing and of course, feel confident. What I style this bodysuit with are the light wash skinny jeans and the snake print mules. So again, this is an easy outfit that you could wear almost any place and look stylish, feel amazing, and of course, feel very confident. All right, tip number six is to don't wait for that particular life event to start wearing what you want. 
because waiting is just not good. Like do it now. I just did a post on Instagram about reaching 40,000 subscribers. And my quote was, she believed she could, so she did. So just believe that you can and do it now. Don't wait, like just do it. That's another one of my favorite sayings. If you're waiting to do something like dress more confident, just do it now. Whatever that is for you, whatever you feel like the best version of yourself in, don't wait for that wedding. Don't wait for that party. Don't wait for that special event. Like start wearing the clothes you love today, right now. I give you permission to do that. You will feel more confident. You will feel like the best version of yourself if you do that. So the look I wanna feature with that tip is this beautiful mint green dress. Because yes, I do have a luncheon to go to later on in the week, but I wanted to wear this dress last week. I didn't really have a whole lot going on, but I wore it anyway. I made my husband take me out to dinner and I wore this dress and I felt amazing. I felt fabulous. Why? Because it accentuates my, my best features, it, it fits really well. I topped it with this beautiful white faux leather jacket, the faux leather jacket I talked about earlier, proving its versatility and wearability. It looks great with denim, but it also looked really good over this midi dress. And then again, I did the snake print mules because they literally go with everything. And as you can see, because I've worn them with almost every look in this video. Okay, the last tip, the one we've all been waiting for, and I think the most important tip is to wear what makes you feel like the best version of yourself. And I'm gonna really focus on the word feel. Like how do you feel when you get dressed? How do you feel when you put on a certain item of clothing? Do you feel special? Do you feel amazing? Do you feel confident? If the answer is no, then take it off and don't ever wear it again. If you feel uncomfortable, if you feel anxious, if you feel uneasy when you put on a black leather jacket, then don't ever wear a black leather jacket. No one says you have to wear anything. You wear what makes you feel amazing and what makes you feel good. A lot of times we're on autopilot and we're in life. We're just going, going, going. We're doing, doing, doing. We're like human doings and not human beings. So sometimes it's good to just take a moment and slow down. And in the morning, if you can slow down while you get dressed and just really pay attention to how you feel when you put on certain items of clothing, then you will know what you love wearing. You will know what makes you feel good and what makes you feel confident. So for me, it's any of these outfits that I've talked about, basically an amazing jacket, a midi dress, or an amazing pair of denim, you know, some beautiful jewelry, some high heels, like that's what makes me feel good. That's what makes me feel confident. That's what makes me feel like the best version of myself. So that's what I wear most often. Whatever that is for you, find out and wear that. Because if you wear what you love and you wear what you feel good in, you will exude confidence and confidence is definitely our best accessory. So some of us like to look very comfortable, but we still want to look incredibly chic. And if that is you, I want to talk about this amazing, very comfortable loungewear jumpsuit from Express. Oh my gosh. When I say comfortable, like literally, I feel like I'm wearing my pajamas. I think this is incredibly chic. It's very, like I said, comfortable. I love the V neckline. It does come in several colors, but I really love this beautiful gray neutral shade. I think a jumpsuit is just a really cool item to wear because it's like one and done. You don't have to think about it too much. You could certainly wear this jumpsuit alone. I think it looks incredibly chic this way, but I also loved it topped with the blazer or even the white moto jacket or even the mint green blazer. Like you could have worn this jumpsuit with any of the jackets and it looked amazing, but again, you can also wear it by itself. But this is very comfortable, very chic. I absolutely love it. So those were the seven style tips on how to dress and feel more confident. I wanna thank Express again for sponsoring this video. Again, every item that I'm talking about will be linked down below in my description box, as well as the sizing information. For more style information, you can head over to SoHeather.com. And on Instagram, I'm SoHeatherBlog. You guys have a beautiful day. And until next time, I will see you soon. Bye-bye.